What kind of ministry have you been doing this month? Well, um, um, yeah. So, um, um, and oh gosh. Come set your rule and reign. We've been going to villages and we've been preaching. English classes during the week. In our hearts again. We've been working with youth. We've gone to three, four different villages. Increase in us we pray. Unveil why we're made. We went out into the villages and kind of met people. Teaching hygiene and teaching English. And um, we taught some American games. Come set our hearts ablaze with hope Like wildfire in our very souls Holy Spirit come invade us now I think the main portion of our time here has been building relationships. Lots of different things we never thought we'd be doing, you know. We are your church power in us. We seek your kingdom first. We hunger and we thirst. We refuse to waste our lives. I've learned a lot about myself this month and just like, despite the heat and the humidity and the rain, <laughs> it's been great. Um, the people here are awesome. They're constantly saying hello to us and just so joyful and always have a smile on their face when we see him. We are your church. We pray revive this earth. I feel like since I've been in Cambodia, I've grown a lot in just, uh, I would say boldness and just stepping into situations that may be a little uncomfortable for me. I think I've gotten a lot bolder in my faith and being able to share. Um, speaking in front of a bunch of strangers is new to me, but I really enjoyed it when I got the opportunity. Unleash your kingdom's power, the near and far, no force of hell can to get to know brothers and sisters of Christ that live in different parts of the world. I've really felt like I've been in my element this month and just that God has put this um, this place on my heart. You just see it just, just coming straight out of them, the love of God. And seeing that in action is teaching me things about myself and about how, I don't know, I just see so much of God's love through them. And that's really hit me.